narayana oham i am narayana i am a glory nara is another name of brahman who are you narayana meaning the whole universe of names and form are all my glory that narayana i am to seek and reach this state that we have embellished him as narayana chaturbhuja vishnu etc that is only for my mind to conceive that formless essence as a symbol but when i reach there and surrender my entire ego and become one with him i realize ayya there is no narayana separate but it is all my own glory the pluralistic phenomenal world that i experienced before are all the glories of that one consciousness disturbed by the mind and therefore i saw them as names and forms but they are all nothing but this brahman alone narayanoham narakantakoham this is the various uh, stories in our puranas naraganda is a, a rakshasa whom the lord destroyed naraka el naraganda destroying the hell meaning as an ego you have been living in a hell you may be living in a palace with the might and power and wealth and all that but your experience is sorry think duryodhana one of the most powerful ravana one of the most powerful men in the world wealthy rich woman wine everything is there but Look at his life! What a tragedy it is! Naraka, he was living in a hell. So long as you are living in an egocentric idea, in spite of the whole universe around you, mm -hmm, you are in a Naraka. You create your own problems and situations and get roasted in it. That is why Naraka is explained as a place where ghee is boiling and then. rakshasas will come and catch you so you can say that hey don't do that i am chief minister prime minister <laughs> they among themselves smile <laughs> how many chief ministers we have done it <laughs> <laughs> so like pappadam being put into it <laughs> the chief minister until it is really become charred you shake it then it is taken by a pakode pakode and all that because the ghee is precious and then it is put there swami ji i don't mind oh what is there 2 minutes i may have a terrible pain and thereafter so then let me live in woman and wine that is all right this is all that you do no then they take a bucket of water is there in which one in a mil thousand or 10000 that is two drops of amrita in it he um mm. it's one finger he takes it and chutkana usme and when that touches this charred bone of yours you get a fat stain <laughs> caught you again we <laughs> were <laughs> again like that naraka this is called naraka hell Yeah, when you are living in ego, you are always in hell. In one boiling pot, 
and then again taken. <laughs> you sleep two days, start another project, <laughs> suffer there. Naraganda <laughs> Goham, this consciousness, the divine, he is the destroyer of this Naraga because the ego is not there. Your experience is totally different. Similarly, Puranda Goham. Purandaka, one who is destroying the Pura, Puri, the cities. You and I are living in this world as a limited ego in three Puris, three towns or cities, states, waking, dream, and deep sleep. You are a waker, dreamer, deep sleeper. It goes on. This is the three, is the triple play of the ego. Shiva is called Trupagandaka. After his realization, he looked and everything burned down. What is all burned down? That can be burned. The infinite cannot be burned. So only the minor, finite world was burned down. Finite world you and I experience through the waking dream and deep sleep stage. Puranda Koham, I am the destroyer of the three worlds. 